seven reasons to seriously consider taking our upcoming full spectrum zygomatic enterogoid implant therapy demystified course that covers everything from A to Z with regard to placement of zygomatic enterogoid implants. To what is the true indication for zygomatic enterogoid implants? We feature a multi-specialty faculty, oral maxillofacial surgeons and prosthodontists. Not just analog approach, but certainly the digital workflow on the restorative end. We have an in-depth, hands-on model workshop for hybrid cases, for a quadzygoma type case, and placement of pterygoid implants, an in-depth cadaver workshop where we're able to place zygomatic implants, pterygoid implants, and feature a number of related anatomic entities that we can work with that otherwise would not be able to be appreciated without a cadaver lab. And last but not least, complications are covered in detail. What can go wrong? How can we prevent these complications and treatment of them? Greetings from Picos Institute in sunny Tampa Bay, Florida. I'm Dr. Michael A. Picos, and I'm here to share with you seven reasons to seriously consider taking our upcoming full spectrum zygomatic and pterygoid implant therapy demystified course. In essence, what separates this course from so many other zygomatic courses that are out there? Well, number one, first and foremost, this course covers four days of comprehensive in-depth material on the topic of zygomatic and pterygoid implant uh, placement, including surgical protocols, prosthetics, etc. So first and foremost, it's a deep dive, and I mean a deep dive into the anatomy of the zygoma and surrounding structures. A full hour of discussion on that, including the pterygoid anatomy and surrounding structures. Indications and contraindications, that's a huge um, plus in terms of value added because in my humble opinion, so many implants are being placed and X number of them, I believe, are not really indicated. And this is just what I see from social media and even from cases that are sent to me by some colleagues of ours. So, number one, in-depth, comprehensive four-day course that covers everything from A to Z with regard to placement of zygomatic and pterygoid implants. And that, again, that includes anatomy. It includes diagnosis and treatment planning in depth. It includes the entire surgical and prosthetic workflow, both digital and analog, and most importantly, complications. So truly a full spectrum uh, comprehensive course. And again, number two, indications and contraindications. How important is that once again? Well, it's the why. Why would we place these implants? What is the true indication for zygomatic and pterygoid implants? Number three, we feature a multi-specialty faculty that includes oral maxillofacial surgeons and prosthodontists. And that's plural, by the way. So myself is the primary presenter, yes, but I also have uh, three members of my faculty uh, Dr. Ken Anderson, Dr. Ed Lippish, and Dr. Les Sultan. In addition, we have two faculty members on the prosthodontist side, and they include our very own Dr. Phil Hedger, who is um, with, in my practice, as well as our visiting uh, prosthodontist, Dr. Safa uh, Tomasebi. So number four, again, having a prosthodontist faculty, that really implies the following, and that is we're able to feature not just uh, an analog approach, which will include smart denture conversion protocols, but certainly the digital workflow on the restorative end that we at my practice and within the Institute have featured now for some five plus years. So photogrammetry, including intraoral scanning, uh, etc., cetera, uh, will be featured. So item number five, uh, we have an in-depth, hands-on model workshop, not just any types of models, but specific models that were representative of and are representative of surgical cases that I have done already. So we'll be able to feature the, uh, the workshop that will allow us to place uh, zygomatic implants for hybrid cases, meaning placement of two uh, zygomatic implants, for example also for a quadzygoma type case and cases, 
And finally, last but not least, placement of pterygoid implants with the models. So model uh, workshop, very comprehensive. And then number six is an in-depth cadaver workshop, which we feature on Saturday morning. And this kind of ties everything together that we will have looked at from a lecture presenting, uh, presenter standpoint, uh, in-depth material um, in terms of videos that will have been shown, uh, et cetera, and even the model workshop. Now it kind of comes together in the cadaver workshop where we're able to place zygomatic implants, pterygoid implants, and a number, feature a number of related anatomic entities that we can work with in terms of buccal fat pad, uh, identification and procurement, and, and placement uh, and application, I should say, of the buccal fat pads to cover our zygomatic implants and, again, related anatomic structures that otherwise would not be able to be appreciated without a cadaver lab. And last but not least, complications are covered in detail. I mean, we're talking three, even three and a half solid hours of nothing but case after case after case of what can go wrong and hopefully, yes, what, how can we prevent these complications and finally, treatment of them. And by the way, uh, these cases uh, are my own. The complications in 95 plus percent of what I present are my own. So I think it's important to be able to, to bear one's soul. And I do this with all of the courses that I have featured at the Institute now for some 33 plus years. So with that said, those seven reasons I feel are super important to look at in terms of why, why would I really want to take another zygomatic and even pterygoid implant course. Well, again, full spectrum zygomatic and pterygoid implant therapy demystified is a very unique course. I invite you to join us for our upcoming course. Thank you.